Good evening. This is evening where I am, brothers and sisters. How are you all doing out there today? You guys are doing all right? Uh, I wanted to say this. I want to say this. Listen, listen. I want to thank each and every new subscriber. I've been getting a nice amount of new subscribers out there and if you're new to my channel I want to welcome you I want to welcome the older subscribers and everybody in between you are welcome to my channel and I'm not doing this for money <laughs> at all but it is a blessing and it is a labor of love this is a call of duty this is my reasonable service and I'm here as a servant and a messenger for you I pray that these messages bless you. I pray that all of these messages open your eyes and I try to keep it authentic and real and raw. And sometimes I can push the button and push the envelope. And a lot of times I may come across as if I'm mean. <laughs> but don't get it twisted. Um, I'm not a mean person. I'm a loving, I'm a giving person, very generous person for those who really know me. Um, and not to toot my own horn, but I, I'm very uh, passionate about um, serving others. And I <clears throat> oftentimes, especially if in my family, I put others before myself a lot of times. <laughs> and it's funny, I was thinking about it today. I'm like, sometimes that could be uh, not so awesome at times because um, when you do that, when you put other people before yourself a lot of times sometimes people might take that uh, it, it, it's not that they may take advantage of you but sometimes they may it may cripple them in certain ways uh, but anyway I want to say that I truly love each and every listener and I um I do this for the glory of God. I don't do this to make myself puffed up or anybody <clears throat> because I'm less than nothing without God. I'm going to say that again. I am less than nothing. And if you're less than nothing, who are we? <laughs> That's absolute zero. Um, but with God, I can do all things. Through Christ who strengthens me. So I'm going to get started. I'm trying to actually talk low. So if I have a monotone type of voice right now, it's because I'm trying to talk low because my son is sleeping. <laughs> and I'm not trying to be so loud. Uh, those of you who know I have a 5-year-old son and a 14-year-old daughter and a 20-year-old daughter. And I thank God for all of my children and my children who are in heaven. If you don't know, I have children in heaven. I have four children in heaven. Yes, I do. If you don't know anything about that, please check out my videos. That's why you got to scroll down and hear my testimonies and hear my, uh, there was a video that I talked about <clears throat> when I talked about miscarriages and the miscarriages I've had. Your sister been through a lot. <laughs> and I believe that this is why God has chosen me to do this um, message forum, some people call it a ministry, I call it a labor of love, um, <clears throat> but either way, I'm here for you, I'm here to help brothers and sisters spiritually, I'm here to help you sort out some things and understand some things and equip you as much as I can, and I'm still learning, in order to fight these demons and fight the devil. Uh, because the devil has an assignment against your life. If you hadn't known, uh, you are uh, a target, if you would, in the enemy's camp. And his job is to steal from your life, to ultimately kill you, and destroy each and every aspect of who you love and everything in your life. So we got to get on board on knowing his strategies and knowing what we can do or what we shouldn't do <laughs> in falling for his schemes and scams and flimflams in our lives. So if I ever come across mean or anything, I'm not a mean person. I'm just passionate and serious sometimes about 
the things that we need to take serious. So without further ado, listen, guys, this was a long intro. Usually I'm not that long winded, but <laughs> sometimes I got to chit chat a little bit. I hope you all are well. But I want to talk about the importance of being grateful and, uh, you know, whether it be little things in your life, big things in your life, you have new events coming in your life, people in your life, your health, your wealth, whatever it is, you know, even if you're a type of person who's just starting out, you know what I mean, in life, and you may have school debt, or you may, my daughter's, you know, in school, and she's juggling a lot of things, and she's juggling work, and, uh, you know, a lot of different endeavors in her life, she's doing great, And, uh, you know, people have challenges as well. So whatever you are going through right now, yes, this moment in time, it is very important, okay, whatever phase or stage you are in your life, God wants you to be content. God wants you to give thanks in all things and be grateful for the little and for the lot. And uh, we have to embrace God like never before in giving him thanks and the honorable thanks that's due unto him. Oh, yes. I think about so many different accidents that could have been prevented um, that happened to people, unfortunately, that that are dead, you know, that are not here with us anymore or tragedies or uh, different people who are locked up or bad things that happen to good people at times. And I think about how God's grace and mercy and heavenly angels are so right on time in our lives. If we think about so many accidents that we could have had And the fact that years ago, he could have been wiped us out and took us out when we were unsaved. You know, things like that puts things in perspective. We all, I know I was deserving of hell. I know I was. Absolutely. And I'm sure that the things that you've probably done in the past, if you wasn't saved right now, your ticket, if you would, to hell would have been a first class ticket. So what am I saying? I'm saying that each and everything in life, we give thanks, we uh, are grateful for the little, for the lot, for everything in between, and we honor God in the way we live. The Word of God says, if you love me, you obey my commandments. And we have to honor God through God's Word, and we have to take serious the journey. You know, we all are walking with God with different phases and different levels and different stages. And we have to enjoy and endure to the very, very end. And we will, during the course of our journey, come across different things. And there may be times where you feel like giving up. There may be circumstances that are in your life that you feel like, God, is. are you there? Are you, <laughs> are you knowing what I'm going through? But I believe if we praise him more, if we thank him more, if we realize it could have been a whole lot worse and that God in his grace and mercy and his love for you has kept you, has kept you, that that's that's more than enough to praise him. So I won't be long, but I also wanted to mention that, uh, you know, my comments, you probably say, why did she take her comments down? Where is she? (laughs) Well, oftentimes I go through different stages of putting my comments up, putting my comments down. And I believe this season is a season for me to shut my comments off and uh, stay razor sharp and focused on the mission. And um, it's not saying that I don't want to vibe with y'all or dialogue with y'all or anything like that. If you want to contact me, talk to me, vibe with me, whatever the case is, okay? Um, I would say um, the last video that did have comments, um, matter of fact, the prayer one, I think I had one where it was like a lot of people, it was blue, and it was a lot of people in a circle, right? And it was talking about, like, if you need prayer or whatever, 
hit me up if you would, like people say, hit me up. <laughs> Talk to me through that one. Um, if you need anything, you at, you have a question for me, whatever the case is. And I'll check that video out, and I'll check those comments below there. If you want to say hi, whatever the case is, um, you want to thank me for a video, wow, that touched me, I appreciated that one, or check this out, y'all, or if you want me to talk about something, a subject, or hit upon this thing that's on your mind, or an idea, video or idea, whatever the case is, that'll be the video uh, that you can... Um, you know, shoot me some information on, but like I said, going forward until, um, the Lord says different, the comments will be off, but like I said, I am accessible, I'm still accessible, and I'm still going to be checking out that, uh, that video area, so if you want to, like I said, shoot me some comments, you can, but like I said, God just put it on my mind in terms of, um, you know, being grateful, it's very important that, we all are grateful because the enemy wants us to concentrate on the issues in life, okay? And uh, the worries and the cares of this life. And uh, God is saying, no, we need to give thanks and we need to have more gratitude and a little less attitude <laughs> with a lot of the circumstances. So I love you guys. My husband just walked in and um, it's husband time, y'all. Got to give my husband some time and consideration. So I love you guys. I will speak to you guys soon in the comments on that channel, uh, on that um, video. And um, talk to you guys later to the next video. Peace. Hello. How are you?